One thing became really clear during this trial, the public loved Johnny. As for Amber, not so much. Hi, good morning. That was evident outside the courthouse and even more so online. My dog stepped on a bee. My child spilled my tea. Adulting isn't free. As I mentioned, this table is Italian. <laughs> Amber, no, stop, no. Amber, no, not on the couch. Amber's team says the jury was tainted because there's no way they could have avoided all this noise. Do you think they did see it? How can you not? They went home every night. They have families. The families are on social media. There's no way they couldn't have been influenced by it. I'm Taylor Lorenz. I'm an internet culture reporter at The Washington Post. I thought this trial was a watershed moment for the internet and for pop culture. It's very much um, reminiscent to me of the OJ trial, where it's something that everyone tuned into and everyone had an opinion on. Amber called the verdict a devastating blow for women. I think there is definitely an anti-Me Too sentiment that's at play here. I think a lot of men have felt frustrated by the fact that, you know, maybe just allegations they feel could ruin their career. Um, and so they're kind of projecting those frustrations onto this trial. You also see a lot of women's rights activists taking Johnny Depp's Side during all of this, saying, hey, look, this is a really public way to make our point that Me Too has gone too far.